Fancy a quick impromptu giveaway? Sure, why not? Hello and a very warm welcome back to the channel. Uh, so this was just a very quick video. Um, you may have noticed that uh, in the community tab a few days ago, I announced that I'd uh, got my next bag of 50 p's. I was going to be doing the hunt, uh, which you may have seen in my recent video. If not, I will put a link to it up here. But anyway, getting back to the point, I asked in the community section in the comment uh, for people to guess how many Benjamin bunnies I'd be finding in the hunt. Just quickly, if any of you aren't aware of the community section, uh, I know you can't actually access it on some smart TVs or uh, or tablets. Uh, I think uh, as long as you're on a, uh, a PC, laptop or, or smartphone, you can get access to it. But uh, yeah, uh, all YouTube channels have a community section where creators can put uh, posts or polls or or pictures or any images. Uh, so if you weren't aware of that, that's definitely something to, uh, to head over and check out. But uh, as I say, getting back to the point, I, uh, I asked people to guess how many Benjamin bunnies we would find in this uh, most recent hunt. Now, um, one of my subscribers, Claire Addison, actually guessed two Benjamin bunnies, which is correct and is the exact amount we found in this, uh, in this hunt. Now, I didn't mention anything at the time, but I was asking for a reason because I want to try and do something a little bit fun. Whereas I'm, uh, what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to be giving away not one, not two, but three coins from the hunt. I'm going to go through them in a little moment, but uh, what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to place them all in this little leather pouch here. And we'll give it a good jingle up, mix them up, and we'll uh, we'll see which uh, which three coins Claire's lucky enough to win today. Now let's open the uh, the pouch up, and we'll go through the coins as we put them in. Now uh, there are going to be three of the 50 p's. Uh, sorry, the, the dictionary is 50p going in there. So let's pop them to them three in there. That's uh, as I say, that's for 2005. Dictionary is 50p. Okay, next up we have three of the 2017 Benjamin bunnies. So we've got three of those going in there. Two of the 2018 People's Axe. Put them in there. One of the new 2022. Queen Elizabeth Memorial with the new Martin Jennings depiction of, of King Charles on it. So we'll pop that one in there. We have one of the 2019 Sherlock Holmes. Put that in there. One of the 2022 Platinum Jubilees. One of the 2017 Jeremy Fishers. A 2022 Pride. A 2017 Peter Rabbit. Here we go, yep, there we go. A 2017 Peter Rabbit. A 2018 Taylor of Gloucester. Uh, just to mix things up a little bit, there's a 2008 Low Mintage Britannia. A 2017 Low Mintage Shield. A 2019 Paddington Bear. Uh, sorry, that's Paddington of a Tower. I don't apologize. 2019 Paddington of a Tower. And this one here, which I've uh, later found out from uh, from after doing one, is a Hungarian coin, uh, a 50 foreign Hungarian. Uh, now, you're not going to be winning this. Uh, what this actually represents, I thought we'd mix it up even a little bit more. And this coin here represents a £5 online voucher. Uh, it could be anywhere of your choice, but I'm thinking something like a £5 Amazon voucher, something like that. So if I pick this coin out, uh, then it's a £5. In fact, I'm just thinking now, that's not really going to work because it's a completely different shape to a 50p. So let me grab this. Uh, it's the Archery, the Olympic Archery. So if the Archery comes out, that's going to be the £5 voucher. That uh, makes a lot more sense thinking about it. So uh, luckily we call that one in time. We'll pop that in there. We will seal the bag up. We'll give it a good little shake just to get them all uh, mixed up in there. And that being the case, without any further ado, I can't see anything I'm doing. Give it a little jingle. And Claire, the first coin you're going to win is a 2018 People's Act. So we'll place that one down there and we'll find coin number two. So. Without any further ado, Claire, the second coin you win is, oh, it's a 2018 Taylor of Gloucester. Nice little coin there for you, Claire. That's excellent. 
And finally, last but certainly with no least, we have a 2019 Paddington at the Tower. So let me get rid of the bag. We'll have a quick look at those. Okay, as I say, we have a 2018 People's Act and Taylor of Gloucester and a 2019 Paddington at the Station. Oh, sorry. Paddington at the Tower. So, that's a little selection of coins there for you, Claire. I, uh, I know you weren't expecting that, but I, uh, I hope that's been a pleasant surprise for you. I'll, uh, I'll reply to your comment. Uh, just ask him for an email address. I can email you from uh, from the stat collector email just to uh, sort out getting those t over to you. Um, I'm thinking about doing something that if, uh, if, if ever anybody wants to, they can just leave the coins and they'll roll over. So if we do this again in the future, there'll be those three coins plus whatever's won at that time as well. But uh, that's, that's going to be completely down to you. And I'll, as I say, Claire, I'll, uh, I'll uh, reply to you in the comments and, uh, and just let you know the good news on that. So I hope this has been a lot of fun. Let me know in the comments if you've enjoyed this, if this is the kind of thing I should do going forward. Um, I definitely love the enjoyment of it. Uh, it's a lot of fun for me to do. So I've got, I've got no problem doing this kind of thing going forwards. Um, but as I say, certainly definitely do let me know your thoughts on this. Did you have fun? Did you have fun with it? Uh, is it something I should do again? Um, but that being said, as always, keep stacking, take care, and goodbye.